Hey CFMA, nobody ever went out of business because they had too much cash, but the opposite may be true. My name is Heather Waldenmeyer and I'm a CFO consultant and I have been working with contractors for over 15 years. And over the years, I have seen a number of contractors who have thrived in hard economies because they've had a really good cash flow strategy. I wanted to share some of my tips for helping grow your cash flow because we are in one of those times where it's more important than ever to be able to manage our cash flow internally. We have seen bank failures, which have resulted in our banks having stricter, tighter regulations around their own lending practices and their own ratios. We have interest rates at record highs and with our margins being what they are, that can be a bit cost prohibitive. So I wanted to give you my two strategies for improving your cash flow internally. One is my short term strategy and one is my long game. Uh, for my short run strategy, I am always evaluating my clients for automation. I am a huge proponent of automation of any kind, but specifically AP automation. Over the years and looking at as many contractors as I've looked at, it seems like AP automation is a go-to that just about everybody is a good candidate for. That could be automating your payments for um, your, your checks that you are issuing, all of your payment runs, generating rebates on those checks and payment runs, or maybe it's automating your workflows so that all of your transactions are going through the same process and fewer items can slip through the cracks. Whichever way you choose to automate, it's so important to be able to optimize your human capital, make sure people are working efficiently, and keep your salaries going to the things that you want your salaries going to. But optimizing your cash flow and having a strong balance sheet isn't going to come from just AP rebates and automation. That is a short term fix. My long term solution is cash flow forecasting. I use cash flow forecasting as my mechanism to be able to not just see the future, but build a roadmap into how I am going to help an organization reach their goals and objectives. I'm able to kind of model out what we think is going to happen and in making sure that I am including things like paying down a line of credit or building up our cash reserves for a rainy day. It's so important to think about what you want the future to look like so that everybody is working in the same way towards the same goals and objectives. So between cash flow forecasting and AP automation, I'm able to really help contractors get their finances in order and take control of their cash flow.